Hi, I'm Javi, the tech team lead at Madfinger Games. Here at Tech Team, we bring together web, cloud, automation, data engineering, and research in order to synergize the potential of all these teams. We try to improve efficiency, reliability, and make it easier to maintain the technologies, and also make sure that we're taking the right decision for the right problem. I'm going to talk a bit about machine learning. Machine learning, as the name may suggest, there's machines and learning. It's as if you started with baby machines that are still untrained and they need to learn how to behave properly. We teach them by showing them several inputs from the world and with these inputs we can always reward decisions that are good and penalize decisions that are bad. In the end, we have a trained algorithm that is behaving properly according to the decisions we need. In gaming industry, we can use machine learning for bots and performance marketing and generating content, for example. Today, we're gonna talk about using machine learning for making bots for an FPS game. How to train the bots to behave like human? Well, it's not very different from how we train humans to behave like humans. So, as babies, we learn how to behave by imitation a lot, also by exploration and the feedback we get from the environment. We can use the same approaches on bots, giving them demonstrations, imitation, making them explore and getting feedback from the environment. And actually they start out quite stupid before all the training, as you can see. It all starts by translating these actions into math. So after we do this work of translating the actions of the bots and behaviors into math, we are able to record a demonstration. This demonstration is basically, we can go inside the game, play a bit, shoot some stuff, and this is gonna be used during the learning of the bots. After we have this demonstration, we can also define what are the good behaviors expected and how much reward to give for it. It's just a score. And we also define what we penalized. For example, we can reward shooting some enemy, and we can penalize walking to a wall, or shooting at the nothing, and this type of things. In the end, if everything goes right, we expect to have a bot that is well-trained, meaning that it does minimal bad behavior, maximum good behavior. Every generation, the bots do more of the good things and less of the bad things according to the behavior patterns that were established. And they try to imitate better and better the model that we provided during our demonstration. I just wish that all kids learned as easy like that. At Madfinger Games, we always try to keep up with the latest technologies. For example, in Shadowgun Wargames, we're using the full Unity Connected Games stack. And some of these services are still in the beta stage, but we will work closely with them to make sure that we get everything right. Our players know that we have developed several models for AI in our previous games, but for Shadowgun Wargames, we felt it was time for something new, something better. Let's just say it started small. It was mostly a proof of concept, and we did not really know how much time it would take to make the bots. In the end, it went well and we actually decided to give time for the babies to grow and see what we would get. As a personal note, I had no idea how fun it could be to watch just a bunch of boxes walking around shooting pink stuff lasers on each other. Like, it's really crazy. And now I even got favorites, you know. I marked some with different colors and I was just watching them. After some time of training and learning how the bots behave, the little boxes turned into the beautiful Shadowgun world and well, the math behind it also got much more complicated. Well, as the saying goes, uh, the student suppressed the master. So at some point, the bots, machine learning bots, got too good. And we could not beat them anymore. Even though they had the same stats as the human players, they could easily outplay us. Or maybe we're just too bad. I don't want to give you any spoilers. I just can tell you that we've been already testing with several players of different expertise and all of them are really enjoying to play Shadowgun Wargames. I hope you enjoyed this little trip to Machine Land. We have a lot of surprises coming up soon and don't forget to come up and pre-register for Shadowgun Wargames to play against the most lovable and best AI in mobile FPS.